Steve, what did you just like about the night tonight? Um, I just liked that we took care of business. You know, I thought uh, we played a pretty uh, – a pretty solid game. You know, our defense was, was good. We uh, basically took care of the ball and, uh, and rebounded well. You know, we out-rebounded them by 10. They, uh, they're one of the best offensive rebounding teams in the league, and we really took care of the glass. So all good stuff. Uh, a lot of guys played well, and, uh, you know, we just did what we had to do. Steph and Draymond back in the fourth, or did they kind of want to be back out there? No, I wanted them back in, uh, Monty, because, um, you know, when the game is sort of right in that 15 range, um, it, 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 things can change too quickly. So we brought them back in at their normal time. I told them both, uh, or I told Steph at least, I said, you know, f two, three good minutes, and then you're coming right back out. And, uh, and Steph – Steph understood, and, and they both went out there and, and uh, you know, just put the lead where we needed it, and then we got them out. So uh, great game from both of them. I, I think Draymond has just been phenomenal. Uh, he's put together uh, a, a great, great season, um, and particularly these last few weeks, his defense is just off the charts. Energy is great. Uh, his leadership has been great. Um, it's just been really fun to watch the, the, the kind of season Draymond has put together. What did you think of Juan's game? I thought Juan was great. You know, Juan did um, what he does. He, he moved the ball. I mean, he, he, um, he had eight assists, I think, and, and uh, always moving, always creating plays just with his movement. Um, you know, on and off the ball. And he's one of those guys who just makes the game easier for everybody. And uh, he's a uh, big reason why we've we've played pretty well here the last month because Juan has given us great minutes night in and night out. Steve, I'm sorry if you were asked this um, previously, um, but we heard from Damian Lee pregame. He said there's no timeline for his return, and he, he went through all of the symptoms that he experienced after that positive COVID test. What do you think about what Damian has has dealt with lately? Well, yeah, I mean, it's shocking. I talked to him about it, and, um, you know, somebody who you know, had the vaccine and then and then gets COVID and, and gets the symptoms. It's so rare. I think um, he said 6,000 out of 80 million. Um, so kind of a needle in the haystack. But um, I'm, uh, you know, I'm, I think it's great that he's being so forthright. Um, I think people need to know uh, what's what's happening. And, and uh, it's great for him to just come out and, and Tell, tell everybody his story. Um, even if you have uh, had the vaccine, you know, it's good to still wear a mask and, and still be as safe as possible as we continue to try to get through this. Um, and as for Damien himself, I, I just, I have so much respect for him. He's such a pro. He's such a good person, great teammate. Um, and I, uh, I feel for him because he's, he's had an excellent season and Obviously, uh, this is really, you know, putting him in a tough spot. He hasn't been able to to work out at all. Uh, so we'll we'll see what happens, you know, basketball wise. But the main thing is he's healthy and feeling feeling better, and and uh, we're obviously relieved about that. Steve, what type of energy or um, an attitude does Kent Bazemore bring to this team? Because it really just seems like he's never down or, or in a bad mood. Yeah, I agree with that. It's one of the reasons we, uh, we, we, we decided to stay with him in the starting lineup just because of the energy that he brings from the outset. He's really good getting into the ball, you know, um, guarding opposing point guards and putting pressure on the ball to set a good tone for our defense. And, uh, and he's a great teammate. Guys love playing with him. Um, you know he's been been in this league for a long time for a reason. He's he's really good, and uh, he's given us a, a a really good lift here in uh, in the recent weeks. Good 
coach, what are your thoughts on Juan Toscano's development this season? Juan has uh, has been fantastic. He impressed us last year uh, when we brought him up uh, from Santa Cruz, and you know we we knew what we had in terms of uh, a guy who just really understood how to play and is a competitor and <clears throat> always brings energy. Excuse me. <clears throat> So I'm a, I'm a huge fan, and I'm going to end it on that because I can't talk anymore. Thank you.